really disgusting idea. Ugh. Guys, it's Lazarus' trash. If we dig through it, we could find some clues. Michaela, I never would have thought of you as the dig through garbage type. Fact. I just wish you had given me a chance to change out of my new heels. They're Mew Mew. At least they were. Look what I found. Who would want to throw these away? I me. would. They're not really my style. Haters. Hey, Cam. Can we use this for a water-powered car? I was kind of hoping that we jumped off that water-powered car cliff. No way. I will take Justin down at the tech fair. Nice find, Adri. Except it's a carburetor. They used to be a big part of internal combustion engines, but have been replaced in the car industry by fuel injectors. You have no idea what she's talking about, do you? No. I just want to go home and take a hot bubbly bath with it. Hey guys, check it out. It's an issue of Cat Fancy Magazine addressed to a Mr. Carson Lazarus. She must get that a lot. Lazarus has a cat. Let's find out. Camera device. Or as I like to call it, Cameron's cat camera to follow a cat around the house device. You know, I think I'm learning the drill. Killer with inventions, bad with names. Well, it works. I routed it through the Innovate server so we could all watch it through our tablets. <clears throat> and Addison. Why did you make a cat cam? I was curious what my sister's kitty Helix the cat did while I was at school all day. And there's Lazarus. Who's hungry? Oh, did I tell you guys? My abuela hired a new chef. That's awesome. Now I'll be able to dedicate more time to Cafe Adam's newest signature blended drink. The... Churachino. I was hoping for some applause. PD applause? <gasps> oh no, Michaela, you have your fro you study session with Kyle! Uh... You know what? We're in the middle of a stakeout, and the clock is ticking on Retro's demand, so I think I'm just gonna cancel. No, you're not. Per the Quail's request, we're under strict orders to help you maintain your social cover as a normal teenager. Okay, but given the circumstances, I think the Quail would agree. Buh, 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 buh. No cancellations. You can't flake. You need to blend in. Like my Chudo Chino. Get it? Blend in? Still nothing? I have no idea what to say to Kyle. I'm good with smart talk, not small talk. You're going to do fine. And I'll be there to help you. You take Addison, and Brian and I will watch the cat cam on our tablet. And we'll let you know if anything exciting happens. <laughs> and nice touch with the glitter light bulbs. It's amazing what a little water, glitter, and glycerin can do. Plus a few portable battery packs. And they match perfectly with my bracelet. <laughs> Look at us. We're smart, talented, and impeccably accessorized. <gasps> the signal's getting stronger. Warmer. Either we're getting close or my hard drive's overheating. The one place with power. This is it. Bye. I need your selfie stick. Which one? Selfie? Super selfie or extreme selfie? Extreme. Addison, it's time to go to work. Wait! I can't go in like this! He'll see me coming! Better. The coast is clear! Ooh! I know how to get into a locked door. I saw it once in a super cool DIY video. I take a picture of the lock, do a reverse image search online to find the exact model, Take a master key, and we're in. Or we can freeze it with liquid nitrogen. Actually, the compressed chemical dichloroethane. If you cool it to negative 25 degrees Celsius, even tough locks become brittle enough to smash open with a hammer. Or burn through it with a thermite reaction using aluminum powder and rust powder. It can be very dangerous, but pretty awesome! Or we could just walk in. That works too, but first let's go dark. Look! My 
regards to Broadway. Game over, Retro. Ah! Girl! You should really think about going out for soccer. Listen, I can explain. Don't waste your breath, Retro. You're going to jail. Kevin, I'm going to take away your TV privileges if you lick one more dirty pan in the sink. Give me a second, Mom! Jeez! You live with your mom, Retro? Or should we say Kevin? Th that's what I'm trying to tell you. I'm not Retro. Well, I mean, I am Retro, but I I'm just an actor. I was hired to play a role. My name's Kevin Glitterman. You can't eat mac and cheese every meal. It's not good for you. Please, Mom, you're not the boss of me! First, don't yell at your mother. And she's right. Too much white flour raises your sugar levels. Hmm. If you really are an actor, then who hired you? I don't know. Every morning, a script and an envelope filled with cash was slipped under my door. And then I'd broadcast live. I knew it was wrong, but acting's my passion. And, and I haven't done live theater since I was a student at Maywood Glen Academy. Wait, you're that Kevin Glitterman? <laughs> we loved you in that production of Annie. Remember, Bri, third grade, Miss Neven took the whole music class? OMG, you were Daddy Warbucks. You signed my program. I actually shaved my head completely bald for that. Why should we believe your Glitterman? Addison, run a facial recognition to check his story. The only reason I took this role was so that I could get my own apartment. I located his headshot and resume. He's telling the truth. weapon. Nobody leaves the building. Going already? But the party's just getting started. <laughs> One coat coming up. Are you? Your worst nightmare. We're sisters. Nice save. I learned from the best. People are starting to leave. You've got to keep them here. What are you doing? Looking over the feed from Maddie's smart contact. There's got to be something we missed. There it is. Something totally irresistible. Craig and Bex is here. Yay! Yay! Wait, why yay? Ears are the new fingerprints. Using a shape-finding algorithm, the outer ear is one of the most accurate ways to ID someone with 99.6% accuracy. Now that we have the image, we can identify Vex. Guys, I need ears. Copy that. I hear you, Bryden. Let's check some ears. <laughs> No matches yet. Keep them coming. Uh, problema, guys? The bed is done. People are leaving. They can't. This is our last chance to capture Vex. We'll search the building. You just have to keep people from leaving. Do something, anything. Adri, tell the band you want to sing. What? You've got to keep the crowd entertained. Me? Now? But I only sing for my family. Never in public. It's our only chance to hold this herd from stampeding the door so we can find Vex. Okay, I'll do it for you guys. For the team. <sighs> Hola! Well, I'm sure that if you're like me, you don't want this evening to end, no. I don't have my ticket right now.
I'm doing my best, folks. We got a lot of coats back here. So quit your laughing! And there goes my tips. Our tips. Come on, come on, come on. Give me a match. So, I'd like to sing a little something in honor of this special occasion. Uh, a duet, actually. Bass player. One, two, three. Sex is the bass player. Well, that's our show. Good night, Mayor Glenn. Not yet. Give me a sec, Addison. I want to check the news before reporting back to headquarters. Sweet, but I wish we could get a peek inside. Remember that fancy pen I gave her in class? Mm -hmm. Camera pen! <laughs> Sorry, Michaela. The quail wants to brief you on the mission status right now. The quail? That must be like a coning for the evil mastermind she's working for. Mm -hmm. I want one of those. I want one of those. Who the heck is this girl? Who wants to know? Ah! Spying on me? Please don't hurt us. We were just. Uh, just, um. Just, uh. Spying on me. Isn't that right, Adrian Adams? Or was it your idea, Bryden Bandwidth? Or yours, Cameron Coyle? She knows us. Of course I do. My organization researches all my new schools before I arrive. They said you're the three smartest girls at Maywood Glen Academy. The three smartest? Not too shabby. <laughs> Not surprised. I'm surprised. A talking notebook? I know it. Let's hope you know enough not to tell anybody what you saw here today. We won't say a word, but please don't hurt us. <laughs> Relax, I'm one of the good guys. Girls. You, oh gee, she's not gonna kill us. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I'm here on a highly classified mission. That's all I can say. By the way, cool listening device. Did you make that? Yeah, thanks. I call it my sound catcher. I'm great at making things, bad at naming them. Well, nice work. I'm Michaela McAllister. Whoa, wait, Michaela McAllister, that's MC. MC squared! No way! I'm squared too! B squared, Kim is C squared, Adrian's A squared. We're like a super cute live version of the Pythagorean theorem. <laughs> Listen, Em, we promise not to say a word about any of this. If you let us check out some of that awesome stuff you have in there. <laughs> okay, look, I can see that you guys are really into gadgets and high-tech stuff, but unfortunately, I just can't. Thanks! Hey. Did she just... She's physical, I'm chatty. 